Pico de Fogo, standing nearly 3,000 metres high, it's Cape Verde's highest point. This whole island of Fogo is one massive volcano, and it's active. The central cone dominates the skyline, on the eastern side of a 9 kilometre wide caldera. Setting out with my friend Tommy, we hiked from sea level to the crater, and then the next day from the crater to the summit, despite problems posed by the weather. Last night, the winds in this part of the crater uh, topped 100 kilometers uh, an hour, and there was some pretty heavy rain. But the sun has come up, and it seems to have quietened down a little, and some of the guides have already gone up. Uh, so we're going to give it a go safely and see how far we can get. It's a real slog, sliding on the scree slopes and navigating the sharp rocks to reach the top of Cape Verde. And after climbing to the summit crater, the sight that awaits is breathtaking. Also surprising is the fact that people actually live up here in an active volcano. Evidence of how active Fogo really is, you can see behind me. That is Shandas Calderas, and the town is being rebuilt on the very lava from the most recent eruption in 2014. After struggling all the way to the top, we found it was much easier just to run back down the 45 degree slopes to the village below. <laughs> 